all in there. <laughs> all right, Gracie, can you tell me your name mm -hmm. and your major here at WPI? Mm -hmm. I'm Melissa Paris, and I'm a psychological science major at WPI. Great, and talk to me. I know you're president of the society, Psychological Society, and you've had a chance to do a wonderful project there. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, well, actually, my junior year at WPI, I got to go abroad and do some psychological research in Costa Rica. And we were looking at um, social tuning in collectivist cultures versus individualist cultures. And so we really got to, we got to design the study, like get the participants, run the data analysis, figure everything out, write a paper that's actually in the process um, of being published right now. So it's all of these experiences. And with that research, I actually got to go on a, um, and present that research at a conference down in New Orleans with the department. So that's really, that project was the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> it's just, I've gotten a lot of experience through the IQP projects here. Now tell me about the, um, the other students who were on the project with you. They probably weren't psychological science majors, right? Actually, she was a psychological oh. science major. <laughs> <Do that. laughs> I know, <laughs> got that out. But yeah, we, I actually, um, I got to go with Professor Skorinko. She like tagged me onto that project that she was gonna do on her own. So. Okay, so as a complete thought, talk to me about the opportunity as an undergraduate student to have a paper published in a global conference. That's unusual. Yeah, really? There are so many opportunities that I've gotten at WPI that I never thought I would be able to get as an undergrad. And one of those is really being part of the research process, getting to research things, some of my own interests, and research things that professors are doing on their own. And I've gotten to run participants and write on these papers that are, have the chance of being published and get to present at all of these different conferences. And those are opportunities that, one, I think, really helped me in getting into grad school, but also were opportunities that I never thought I would be able to experience as an undergraduate student ever. <laughs> Talk to me a little bit about the, the culture of WPI, academically as well as socially, mm -hmm. and, and how what that has meant to you these past few years. Well, I actually transferred into WPI as a for the psychology program, and I think what was so important to me was that it was such a small program, and you really got to get to know a lot of the professors, and you got to work with them on their research, and you got to do your own, and you really got to work hand in hand with them, and they brought you through that research process from start to finish. And I think that culture of really getting to know the faculty and the other students in the department, really, it, it was the hugest difference between that and going to a much larger school. Um, I, I just don't think that you can really get those opportunities um, in another place. <laughs> what about being president of the Psychological Society? Well, that's really helped. I think being president of the Psychological Society has been a really big role in um, getting to know a lot of the other people in the department, um, a lot of the other psych majors, even people who aren't psych majors who are just interested in psychology and maybe how that can relate to their major. Um, it can relate to a lot of different things, a lot of um, business, um, different types of engineering and biology. You can really adapt it to fit to what you're going to do in your future. So I really got to meet a lot of people who I wouldn't have necessarily met just being in my own major. Um, and we've gotten to, we've got to do um, different types of activities. We went to a couple schools in the Worcester area, um, middle schools, to talk to them about the psychology program here and even just going to college in general. Um, and we're getting involved in volunteering at um, one of the local hospitals. So it's really just um, spreading out a little bit and, and putting our hands in different things besides just being in the lab and doing psych research. Talk to me about where you're headed now. Well, next year I'm actually going to be studying organizational psychology at City University London. Um, I'm really interested in psychology in the workplace and um, motivation and investment within an organization. And so I actually got that, um, I found out that that was really what I wanted to do at WPI. When I came here as a psychology major, I wasn't necessarily sure what I wanted to do with that. But then actually spreading out to some of the other departments here, um, taking some um, organizational behavior and change classes and taking some business classes, I really saw that I could adapt what I've been learning in psychology to all of these other areas, and I really found out that I loved organizational psychology, so I'll be going to London in the fall. That's great. Yeah. Now, I don't know if, if this has ever come into play for you, but a psychology major at WPI is not necessarily something you right. associate with WPI. I've talked to physicians who've gone to school here who said that there's a as an engineering school are known for that, it's kind of like by osmosis you take on that engineering way of thinking and that even helped them as physicians. Did you have any experience like that as a, 
a psychology student at WPI? Well, I think that for one, psychology, the department gets maybe overlooked at WPI. Just, and that might be because the departments here, so many other departments have such strong reputations. And that's, and that's great, but I think that um, also taking a lot of these technical classes here at WPI has been extremely helpful. Um, I know that I've taken computer science classes, um, I've taken other sciences um, in order to strengthen my psychology experience. And also having other people who are really tech-minded um, has helped with um, really strengthening and honing my skills on learning how to um, code different programs. And these are things that I've used in psychology in creating different um, studies and um, creating things on the computer and all of these different things. So it's really, it's really helped, I think. What we miss most? Oh my goodness, a lot. <laughs> I love WPI. I think that uh, I don't. I don't know what I miss most. I just love being able to like hang out on campus and meet so many different people that you wouldn't have necessarily met otherwise. Um, especially being a psych a psych major, you kind of get to um, spread out to a lot of these other departments. And I don't know. I just I think it's such like a homey feel at WPI. And the second I came here, I knew that. This is where I wanted to be, and I think that that really carried out through the rest of my time at WPI. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna miss being on campus, I guess. You can be a higher to follow. That's been great, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. then 